Silence! Your words are meaningless here. Your blood will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Barato! Forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. The gods smile on you. For now. Take this one back to the cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. Luck? No. No luck for these dogs. General, we should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. The moon god sent you to destroy my kingdom. I know it, girl. I see everything. Look around you. Is this hall not famous enough for my mistakes? Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The Moon God sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. And what news from below? There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Starting with this one. <laughs> Tell me, General. Does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen? Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Kill her. By your command. <laughs> <laughs>
gods give me strength. for forgiveness, but the gods don't listen. And now he too is silent. My king? Free of his madness now, as are we all. Free? Free to die. This is your temple. What can we do? There is a way out through the catacombs. I think I should trust you. You have no choice. I've got you. An Akkadian? Scared of a rodent? I have seen it all now. How many men died for our king? Their sacrifice bought him nothing.
are cursed by our own actions. Why did your king create the temple? Same story that history has taught us. For gold, for glory, for greed. Here, help me with this. First, we're safe down here. You first. What is this that adorns you? Nothing to concern an Akkadian. How do we get out of here alive? The enemy of my enemy is a friend. We help each other. There is always hope. What was that? How many ways into this tomb? We're not alone down here. Over here. No escape. Our only hope is to stand together. No! If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword! Won't you spare me over till another
edge of an abyss. Your survival depends on the choices you make. They will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation or be lost in the darkness forever? Let me speak plainly. You're about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. It's good to see you again. You're probably keen to get started. Let us not dally any longer. As you are aware, I am the curator, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. It is filled with untold stories. Stories about friends and enemies, loyalty and betrayal, life and death. Understand that I am not here to help you. Although I have been known to bend the rules from time to time. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures. Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow a future best avoided. But alas, the sands of time have run out for us. We'll meet again soon to see how you fare. Or fail. Particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. Apologies for arriving early, Lieutenant. Things are moving fast. I hear you, Colonel. I'm glad to have you on board. The techs are ready for your presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, you're good to go. You should read this. Didn't you hear? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. You are? This is my assistant, Clarice Stokes. Dr. Clarice Stokes. Kolchak. First Lieutenant Kolchak. Well, the briefing room? What's up, Marine? Can't you keep up? This could be our last time together, Rachel. After what happened at the checkpoint, I, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five.
fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. All right, Rachel. Are you going to tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's got to be over. Come on. Maybe I just don't think this is the right time. That's bullshit. There's never a right time. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. I'll see you at the briefing. Shit. You have to excuse the noise and disorder. We're just getting the base set up. <clears throat> Blows my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> Chowing down on candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenail. Nice image. Uh, if only you could see the state of this place now. Makes me smile. <laughs> We got the CIA, we got the Army, the Marines, DIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone's invited. Everyone wants a piece of history. God bless America. I see you, old man. You're busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later. We have company. Yeah, well, you miss here would like to watch me get my sweat on, huh? You wanna spot me, little lady? I'll see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin, he likes social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. Sergeant Kay. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So, what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. Civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. <laughs> the one and only satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the Colonel full sight access. Sir. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. Rachel and I, we know each other. She'll understand all's fair in love and war. Sir? The queen bitch you're referring to is his wife. Nice work, hot shot. Sir, I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So, she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Brett, 
Let's get you set up. I hope the bandwidth can cope with the data. I'll leave the techie stuff to you. And I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. We got a deal, lady. What is this place, anyway? Looks like an old ballroom. Uh, that's exactly what it is. I guess you damn like to get down on the dance floor. I think if his dance partner stepped on his foot, it'd be an instant off with her head. <laughs> well, it wouldn't surprise me. Maybe when we're done, I'll let you spin me around. <laughs> as long as you don't step on my foot. King. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. I should have warned you I was moving the briefing forward. That's on me. But things escalated, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders. I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. Truly. I'm sorry, Rach. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Sock Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm gonna need access to your network. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something? What the fuck is that? Modern art or something? This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there in their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What the fuck are we waiting for? I'm ready. It's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake, those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah, too many birds could bring them down on us. We move fast in, fast out. Yeah, that's pretty much what your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. If I didn't pull out so fast, it could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your call? We keep this thing small. If it goes south, I'll pull the plug and we can bug out. With all due respect, I think that's the wrong call. With all due respect, Lieutenant Kolchak, it's not your decision to make. This feel right to you? Merwin has a point. If we spin up too many helos, we'll increase our chance of being spotted. Any concerns, see me after the briefing. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. 
This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Larisse, help me stop the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie. Look, the rough down will sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm gonna download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric, we need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. Rach, this is it. Everything I've worked on these past years, it's ready. This is the big break we've been waiting for. This isn't about us, Eric. I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it, things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse. A lot worse. <sighs> Nothing has changed, Eric. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach, don't say that. You're not wearing your wedding ring. <clears throat> hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit, sorry. What you got in that box of tricks anyway? What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you? Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. Is this what I think it is? WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke, that's all. These are only to be used for cover. Understood? Understood. After all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions, not us. Think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? If he's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. Sir, I've heard some fucked up stories about the border. You sure you don't want air support? There's a chance we'll need him. We have the element of surprise on our side. I will not allow anything to jeopardize that. Please, Colonel. Can we take a step back and think about this for a minute? I've made my decision. You feeling lucky, Lance Corporal? Well, my parents owned a horse named Lucky. He ran away. Bet the farm on this. I have a good feeling we're gonna clear up. 
I wish I shared your optimism, Colonel. What the hell do we need this crap for? We need to be mobile. We need to be prepared. The facility is underground, possibly under construction. It's safer this way. You want me to feel safe? You give me some more shooters. So, you're my technician. I've heard about you. I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. I'm sure I'll manage, Colonel. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. Download's complete. Let's get to the helos. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. Who do you think I am? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of him? Like he's got something else on his mind? Then, and again. Then.
boys. Go ahead, Zoe. Zehn?
زين تاني يا هبل الو الو انا سليم 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 جاركو ابو زين اي رجعت هو زين مع مع هو زين مع ابنك طارق ايوه طارق هما مع بعض راحوا ياخدوا الاتوبيس بقالهم ساعه كلهم خير؟ لا كله مش كويس لقيت الحاجات اللي سرقها وخباها طارق وزين زين قال لي انه بطل الحاجات دي وعدني من ده البوليس ايه لا مش عايزين الصيع دول معانا انا هتعامل معاه في معرفتي انت بس قولي لي هم فين انا انا مش عارفه اول ما يدخلوا من الباب تقولي لزين ابوك عارف انت عملت ايه قولي له ابوك غضبان منك لا 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 يا ديني مش دلوقتي أوه. كابتن بصري اهلا انا مولاي لازم اتحرك على طول انت بتقول ايه سعادتك العدو جاي يا سليم العدو جاي علينا دلوقتي العدو يا فندم الحرب خلصت خلاص وخسرنا لا ده كلام فارغ محدش السل العدو جاي ودي ارضنا واحنا لازم نتعرب ليها شايفينهم مطلوب تاكيد يلا شوف جايين علينا بقول لك احنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه لاحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا تمام يا فندم خلاص يا دار دي اخر مهمة You two want to cut the bullshit and focus on the mission? Hey, only one place I let a woman boss me around like that, all right? And that's between the sheets. I'm surprised your mom lets women into your bedroom. Don't want her getting jealous now. Damn right. Hey, the fuck y'all laughing at? Sergeant Kenny, I need you to establish contact with the AWACS CP on four-hour intervals. Sergeant K, are you with me? Yeah, I got it. Contact CP every four hours. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm straight. What's going on in there? Just some shit I gotta work through, man. It's all good. I'm chill. I got your back, Nikki. No matter what. I know it. Make sure you do. Semper Fi. Semper Fi. Semper Fi? What's that, some kind of Boy Scout thing? It's a Marine thing. It means always loyal. So what, it's supposed to be lucky? Marines have a boatload of superstitions. Hit me with one. 
All right, check it out. They say to never look back when you're disembarking the Hilo. Otherwise, you curse the whole team. That's got to be about the stupidest thing I have ever heard. Yeah, well, maybe. But as I see it, why take a chance? Eyes forward at all times. You look backwards in a war zone. It's no wonder you get your ass shot off. Good to go, Marines. It's what we were sent here to do, and may God be my witness, we're gonna succeed. Amen to that, brother. Hoorah! 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 الخنازير بيطيروا هيهبط؟ خلوا نفسكم يا رجالة American, El Asakir, El American, go. Sir, we've been made. Awaiting orders. Ben out and hold fire. We're gonna psyops this shit. إحنا الأمريكان. إحنا الجيش الأمريكاني. Compound is secured. Prisoners are playing ball. Roger. Get Corporal Merwin to pop yellow smoke at the LZ and bring in the Colonel. This rig's a bust. These people are not the enemy, they're just shepherds. Lieutenant Kolchak, sit rep if you will. No shots fired, sir. No casualties. Farm is secure and we're processing captives. Captives? Have you located an entrance to the underground silo? Negative, sir. If there is one, it's well camouflaged. If there is one? What does that mean, Lieutenant? Colonel, I don't think these men are hostile. I'm starting to think they're just shepherds. Are you sure? Could it be a cover? You may be right. If these are civilians, Lieutenant Kolchak made the right call to not go in guns blazing. That went smoothly. You think? Got the place locked down tighter than the virgins. Do not finish that sentence, Corporal. Are they ready for questioning? Yeah, just don't ask them any tough physics questions. Let's go. Stay sharp. If anyone so much as raises an eyebrow, I want to know about it. Copy that. I don't know about you guys, but something doesn't feel right about this place. Oh, yeah? So is that this, uh, women's intuition I keep hearing about? Yeah, you want to find out what happens when you piss it off? Stay still. I'm just gonna pat you down.
السلام عليكم يا أخي لازم أسأل السؤال ولازم تقول الحقيقة فين مدخل مخزن السلاح I'll make him talk. Stand by. I've got this. هسألك مرة ثانية فين مكان المخزن؟ The hell is that? Some kind of effigy. Possibly pagan. ايه ده؟ هتعرفوا قريب What the fuck؟ انتوا كام هنا؟ enough of this. Corporal, keep an eye on the captives. You heard him, Marine. Tell me where the silo is. This man was armed, ma'am. Everyone in this country is armed. This is a big deal, a lot more than you need to use the land. Where is the entrance to the prison? Do that again, and I'll tear you up into pieces and feed you to the fucking jackals. Are there any more captives? Yeah, in the other hut. Follow me. Keep a firm eye on this one. Shit here. You got something to say, Sergeant? Look at the ground. What do you see? Jack shit. There was a silo. Where's all the tracks? No. Man, this is a fishing expedition. His precious Kalis has got it all wrong. We follow orders, Sergeant. The search is far from over. Aye, sir. That's heroin. It just keeps getting better by the minute. These people are nothing but common crooks. What the fuck was Eric thinking? I want this place turned inside out.
They're up on the ridge! Return fire! Go! Nick. Bullshit. Ah. I know you're hurting, but you're not fucking dying. <coughs> well, still, calm down. Your flesh when it's a paper cut. Just hold still. I... Say it, Primo. This is dropkick. Silence lifted. Can someone give me a sit rep on the contact? Over. Dropkick, this is Killjoy 2. We are under fire and going down. Targets have advanced into the LZ. <sighs> this getting worse? Or I swear I'll put a fucking hole through you. You better not miss. Jason! 
Jason! Jason! I'm close, man! I'm coming! this place. That's something. Where on God's green earth have we landed? We need to get back topside, regroup with the rest of the squad, and signal for medivac. This place ain't no weapon silo, but it's sure as fuck crawling with Iraqis. Nick? Sergeant Cade, pull yourself together. Eyes wide. Saw something. What do you mean, saw something? I mean, it wasn't human. In a tunnel. <sighs> Should have never gotten off that helo. I fucking knew it. I knew you weren't ready for this. I swear to God, do not get God involved in this bullshit. Now, I don't want to hear another fucking word. You pull your shit together right fucking now before you get us both killed. You gotta believe me. No, you believe this, Sergeant. You didn't see shit. We need to get out of here right now. You ever seen anything like this? What the hell is this place? Guys, long history at school. You don't feel it. What, Nick? Feel what exactly? I don't know, some. I don't feel shit. You sure about that? <clears throat> oh. 
this thing is heavier than it looks. Give me a hand. I'm gonna need some more muscle. He's giving Jim again. That's Merle. Jesus, I'm mm. trying. Will you stop squirming around? He's bad. He's bleeding out. We have to cut him down right now. Hold tight, buddy. We got you. Nick, I need you here. Cut the wires. Oh, I fucked. He's so fucked. You don't think I can hear you? You're gonna pull through, brother. Check it out. There's no feet in my back. Grab it. We're gonna pump you up, okay? Hurry the hell up! We got this. You keep lookout. Fuck! Look out for what? Jesus, who the hell loaded these packs? What the fuck just happened? أنا الملازم سليم عثمان بكل الجنود أنتوا فين؟ حول أنتوا فين؟ هو بتاع الماشي كابتن دار هذا تسمعني؟ عد الرسالة حول كابتن زفت بدك تسمعني انا مش عارف في 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 كهف بحاول اخرج بحاول اخس آه. 
كان عندي مشاريع النهارده استحمى اسمع موسيقى احتفلت من ادبني بس لا دق على باب انا لا لما كان جايين لما كان جايين بص احنا فين دلوقتي والله ما انا عارف انا فين في حد موجود هنا في حد هناك يحب يشوف ده مين هناك؟
bottom place is about to come down. Are you okay? Are you hurt? I'm good. Did you see Sergeant K? Kolchak? Last I saw, they were together. I tried. Something's interfering with the signal. That could be another way out. I don't know. You know I've got your back, Rage. Stay close, you'll be fine. I'm pretty good at looking after myself, Eric. It would seem so. <clears throat> Carabiners, quick draws, rope, light. Shit. Okay. All good? All good. Let's do it. Well, that's a steep drop to nowhere. We've got rope. Hey, look. There's an airflow. I say we climb. So when did you start smoking? Excuse me? The lighter. Uh, it's nothing. Just something I picked up back at base. Are you ready? Are you? This place doesn't look much like a weapon silo to me. If there's nothing down here, then why were we attacked? There's a war on. People tend to shoot each other. I guess we could classify this as quality time. You and I always did have a different view on quality time. Remind you of old times, Rage? You mean the sense of feeling lost? Ancient. Maybe that's cuneiform. Sumerian, maybe? What is this place? You're quite the expert on history. Didn't realize. Maybe you don't know me as well as you think. seems stable. Yeah, it looks fine. A certain cool under pressure. What 
What do you think this place is? Hard to say. These carvings look religious. I think we may be in a temple. something down there even in ruins this place is still something special wonder what happened here think we can move it looks jammed pretty tight 